Hello, my beautiful Gemini's. Welcome to your weekly reading, weekly energies. This is for the second week in March, the week when we have also a new moon. March 10th, we are experiencing a new moon in Pisces. And really, really, for some of you, my trigger, since you are a mutual zodiac sign as Piscean and definitely dual zodiac sign. Definitely the trigger could be on the emotional level or could be on other levels. Let's see, loves. New moons brings the new. Let's see what new is there for you and what else comes in that definitely looks like something that you didn't really look for or didn't really encounter gemini sun moon rising signs and venus my highly resonate with you this reading might be here and there a message four of pentacles seven of wands seven of pentacles is like some of you might tell yourself that not yet just a little bit more Nine of Swords, Four of Cups, and the Hierophant, and the Death. For some of you, there is a situation here that it's, it's over, or it's about to be over, but you could refuse that it's over and that will be fixed. There's something here that... It's about accepting that something here is changing or needs to change. For some of you, it could be the relationship you are in. For others of you, it could be your job. Because something here really speaks of it's time. And you know it's time. Even though it's hard to accept this change that's coming in. So many, many of you Gemini's, you, you might have hard time to accept something, but this week feels like, you know, what if I will change and what if I'll be good about it? First card, we have the Queen of Cups. Definitely here it's about acceptance, allowing the things to be there and not resisting this you know, acceptance or allowing the energies. Look at here, there's so many cards of no, no, no. Knight of Swords. But it's kind of once you accept, the things will uh, move faster than you think. Whoever here you are dealing, whoever here you are or whatever situation here you need to accept. For some of you, you might deal here with the water sign. For others of you, you might, um, you might need to act like a water sign because water and air, let's see, it was the Queen of Cups here for Ch Chariot. This is something here about movement or allow some kind of movement or allow yourself to move forward. What else? King of Wands. It's kind of allow the, um, the actions into your life. Two of Cups. For some of you, it's hard to accept that someone here loves someone or is moving forward with someone or choose to move forward yes five of wands there's some kind of um, argument here spirit says act in a mature way or Yes, some, sometimes either you need to allow someone to go or someone here have a hard time to let you go. Was the Knight of Swords here? Three of Swords. 
yeah there's something here that really hurts you and that's why you can't accept eight of swords two of pentacles it's kind of you you till the last minute or till the last breath you you feel like maybe it's not right or maybe it's not true three of cups this is more likely a third party or something here that it's hard to again make peace with look at this two of pentacles two of swords two of cups the two of wands is missing so somebody here make a decision now it's time for you to make your own decision let's see was the nine of wands seven of cups you still kind of need an explanation or you don't understand what's going on the sun it's kind of maybe you will make I, I have a Leo energy or you kind of like feel like I will wake up and will be different was the two of swords the temperance queen of swords king of swords queen of swords king of swords yeah so for some of you this is um, a commitment that you refuse to let it go but I feel here temperance it's here and it's telling you it's okay to let you go to let it go four of swords there is healing there's a lot of healing For some of you, definitely here the, um, the acceptance that there is life after an ending. And that's how it is here. So things are changing for you. Let's see what else. Or where are you moving towards at this point or at this time? Another thing here, what I'm hearing. For some of you, even though you feel it's hard now to let go of something, you're actually moving towards your four of wands. And why I see that? Four of cups, four of pentacles, and four of swords. The four of wands is missing. So whatever here you felt it's happiness, or you imagine happiness, you did not yet experience. So letting go something, actually will lead you to there which is your true happiness so don't don't hold so hard on something because i feel here as the spirit says you did not yet see what really speaks happiness what else judgment I feel here very soon you will understand certain things that you had a hard time because when we resist certain things when we don't want to see certain things we cannot see the true meaning look at here you'll start feeling more confident you'll start feeling much better about yourself and definitely here there is a lot of improvement for you ace of wands it's kind of like in a week or even in a day you'll see very much in a different position three of wands and it's like something here you manifest loves and this manifestation comes now or starts now i it's it's quite hard that the um, the tower didn't came here because so much resistance so much like no 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 i don't want this no 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 why should i change why should the things not going this way but it's kind of the universe pushes you the universe has your back darlings and the universe is look at here ace of wands and three of wands makes all together the four of wands so the universe is pushing you to that energy you're supposed to be 
Let's see advice for you, darlings, from Spirit. We have the Magician. So definitely here you manifest something bigger. And to have whatever here you manifest, you got to leave this behind. It, look at here. Lovers, moon. is like to not be afraid to choose you. And High Priest, wow. Wow. Six of Cups. So whatever here you manifest, it could come in a month, in a week, or the latest in six months. But there's something here you need to let go, which is the past. Or something here that it's consumed, or it's done, or it's ended. Okay? Wow. Gemini's. Look at this major arcana. There's... There's an insane energy here. So listen to your intuition, loves. Listen to your intuition and don't be afraid to choose you and to choose what your inner voice is telling you. It's speaking to you. Because definitely here something scares the shit out of you. But whatever here scares you will lead you exactly where you need to be so let them go or let it go whatever the energy the situation is there okay love and light loves thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye for now